Hey everyone, it's Mona and I'm in the craft room and I'm going to be doing some more Christmas ornaments today. What I am doing today is using these little glass globes that are from Oriental Training. And they're these little tiny guys and what I've done is I took a box, flipped it upside down and I stuck these dowel rods through there. And this makes a perfect little holder for these ornaments when I'm painting on them. Now these ornaments come with these little metal tops and all you do is pull it right out and that way you can put it right on the dowel like that. Now the paint I'm using is this plaid folk art multi-surface paint and you can put it on glass and I had read this before if you let it air dry for 21 days it will cure onto the glass otherwise you can bake it and it says you gotta go to the website to find out how long to bake it so what I am going to do is easy. We're going to do polka dots. We're just going to have fun, fun, fun with this. And we're going to use some bright colors. Now what I'm going to be using is a dowel and a skewer stick. That's all I'm using. These are the colors that I'm using and I'm a little on the fence about the eggplant. So I'm not really sure about that one yet. We'll just have to see how it goes. Now I'm going to start with the bigger dowel rod and I think I'm going to start with the red. And I can take this right out if I want and I'm going to just make some polka dots. They don't have to be perfect polka dots. And there is that one. So I'm going to let that dry. And I'm going to wipe off the dowel rod with an old towel. And this one I am going to take a little bit of a different approach. I'm going to do green. And then I'm going to do some blue. And then I will follow up with another color. And I think I'm going to go with this melony pink. And then I'm going to put that aside to dry. While these are drying, I am going to take another one, and this time I'm going to take my skewer stick, the pointy end, this one actually got a little damaged and broken, but makes no difference, and I am going to take this blue and do some swirls. Just swirl around, makes no difference if they're neat, if they're messy, it does not matter. And there is that one. And you can even just leave it like that. That's kind of cute. We'll put that aside to dry. And this one I think I will do orange. And I'm going to do the back of the skewer stick this time. And I'm going to just do little dots all over the place here. Okay, there is that. And I'm going to take the yellow and just kind of put some dots in between. Put the back of the skewer stick again. And there's that one. We'll put that aside. Now this one looks like it might need a little bit of a splash of color and I'm going to go with the eggplant. And here it is. I like that a little bit better with the dark in there too. Here are the four ornaments and they are all finished. And this is the one that I was actually going to add other stuff to it originally, but I like it so much just the way it is that I decided just to leave it with those little squiggly squirrel swirly things. Let me put some white behind it. See how cute that one looks? And here is the green and red polka dots, which it's easy. It's so, so easy. Here's the multicolored polka dots. And you can use these for Christmas and, you know, go on traditional colors. It doesn't matter. But you could use these for other things, too. You know, they would even be cute hanging maybe like at a wedding or something like that and just do the wedding colors and polka dots or anything. Look how cute they are. And you can throw some glitter in there if you want to. So there they are and I hope you like them. I hope you give them a try and let your creativity run wild and come up with all sorts of fun and crazy stuff. And we'll see you next time everyone. Thank you so much for watching. Happy holidays and happy crafting.